Jim, it's great to have you uh, back with Commission uh, mm -hmm. speaking uh, for us. Uh, tell us, what, what are the benefits of belonging to a church planting network like Commission? Well, um, I do think that churches ought to be part of a denomination. People, uh, churches ought to be part of a, uh, uh, you know, an accountable structure that has specific doctrinal commitments. But uh, the, the network is a uh, an organization of churches, some of which may not be in the same denomination, that have a very similar vision for church planning and reaching uh, the ministry, um, reaching the world. And uh, years ago, I had a professor that said, there are uh, white corpuscles and red corpuscles. Red corpuscles are um, uh, ministry ideas, ministry vitality, uh, philosophy of ministry. White corpuscles are ways of dealing with infection. So I've actually found that in, uh, in for example, Redeemer's a Presbyterian church. Being part of the Presbyterian church, the pres my denomination is sort of that's the white corpuscles. I, I'm accountable. I believe in our statement of faith. But the denomination all by itself is not enough to give me the red corpuscles. I need like-minded churches that have every bit as much of an outreach orientation, that have a similar vision for reaching cities. And that's where I get my red corpuscles. And therefore, you really do think, I think, need to be part of a, a network of an association of like-minded Christians and churches that have a similar vision for reaching the world. And you'll be aware that uh, Commission is trying to reach not just one class of people, but with a whole variety of different ministries, and that slows us down a bit because it's well, costly doing that. It's, it, that's right. It's also true that denominations tend to be either upper class or lower class or middle class, and uh, whereas networks with a desire to reach all sorts of people can very often bring folks together with a common vision for ministry, but they actually are from their different ethnic groups, uh, in some cases different denominational backgrounds, and yet we want to reach the city, and sometimes the association can be more broad and uh, diverse than a simple denominational structure can be. And so it's very important to have these kinds of networks.